2. Vocabulary Look at the words and phrases in bold. These words are in bold. This is not a word, this is a phrase. It consists of three words. It's a phrase. You find their opposites. What are opposites? Opposites are like Cold is the opposite of hot. Hot is the opposite of cold. These two, cold and hot, are opposites. You find the opposites of these words and phrases in the dialogues on page 34. For that reason, if you haven't watched the previous video, 3A1 Listening and Reading, please watch it before you continue this video. The dialogues are in that video. And complete the sentences with their correct form. 1. You should start saving money. When you save money, you keep money in a safe place to use it later. Don't use the opposite of saving money. Go to the dialogues on page 34 and find the opposite of save and that is spend. When you spend money, you give it. When you save money, you keep it. Don't spend it on things you don't actually need. Buy things you don't need. The good thing about cash machines is that you can deposit. When you deposit, you put money in your bank account. Or you can deposit or what? The opposite of deposit is withdraw money. You can withdraw. That means you take money from your account without having to wait in a queue in a line like this to see a bank clerk. A bank clerk is a person who works for the bank to help clients. 3. Charlie. This man is Charlie. He refused. When you refuse, you say no. Refused, he said no, to go on a business trip. When you go on a business trip, you travel to another city to conduct business, not for fun. To London, but I... What is the opposite of refused? It is accept. I accept. I say yes. Refuse? No. Accept? Yes. 4. I spelled the name on the envelope. This right here is an envelope. And I spelled the name. Spelt is the past of spell. When you spell, you form words by writing letters. The name was spelled correctly, in a right way. But I spelled the address. Address is the place where I live or the place where I want to send the envelope. I spelled the address, the opposite of correctly, is incorrectly, incorrectly, in a wrong way. 5. We had to pay. Had to is the past of have to. It means must. Pay, give money. 1,000 euros. For the furniture, furniture like uh, sofas, chairs, tables, we bought some furniture, but the delivery, delivery is the act of bringing goods, bringing the furniture to my house, my place. The delivery was, you had to pay, no, you don't have to pay, means it's what? It is uh, free of charge, free of charge, you don't pay, it's free. Thank you for watching this video. If you like it, please share it with friends. I'll see you again next time, inshallah. Goodbye.